Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Chakur Chocolate Assortment. And this has the uh, Neuschwanstein Castle on the front, and it is in Germany. Uh, these were $8.99 at Aldi, but they're actually, it says they're actually made in Poland, a product of Poland. When you buy these, they are covered in just a clear wrap. I took that off so that I could see how they came, so that I could take a picture before we started, because um, I didn't know how they were gonna come. You get uh, 13 different chocolates, and they do have a cheat sheet here, which I love. Mm -hmm. So I like you get, it's on the bottom. All right, so you get a layer here with the cheat sheet, and then you get another cheat sheet with the bottom layer. So you're not having to flip over to the bottom and try to look at everything. Three pieces are 180 calories. So this is the cheat sheet. We're gonna and eat lots of chocolate. We're gonna be eating lots of chocolate. We um. We are going to half each one of these uh, because think about it, three pieces, 180 calories, 13 pieces, that would be a lot of calories if we ate a whole one ourselves. <laughs> so we're definitely going to be halving them. I love the little Christmas one with the hats and the trees on it. Why That's don't you really take cute. that one first? That is called chocolate chip cookie. You'll see it when, you, when she shows you the picture, but it's really, really cute. It's got a print on the top of it. Yes, yes, and it's chocolate chip cookie. Yeah, um, I wanted to make sure I got a picture before we ever started because I wanted to, you all to be able to see, but I didn't know that it was gonna have two layers, so I didn't know that sometimes we eat the entire box and there's nothing left. Yep, tastes more hazelnut to me, but I do get chocolate. Do you get hazelnut, or is that just my imagination? Mm. And maybe it's just chocolate with the, the chocolate cookie pieces. It's got like little pieces of cookie in it. It just tastes like a very rich chocolate to yeah. me. Yeah, I don't know. It has a, a hint of hazelnut to me, but it's probably my imagination. They're calling it chocolate chip. It has little pieces in it. Like, like, like it's uh, like cookie pieces. Right. But it's, um, I, I would not have guessed the name of it to be chocolate chip. But it does have little crispy pieces. Yeah, in it's it. almost like a chocolate crunch. Yes, exactly. But I do like the chocolate. Mm -hmm. It's very, very good. The very, chocolate's very nice. rich. Uh, why don't you try this one right next to it? This one. And this is called milk chocolate almond cream, and it looks like a, a little mini uh, one of those match matchsticks that they sell over in the UK. That's what it looks like is a matchstick. Very creamy. That's good. I didn't realize that there were actually multiples here. Mm-hmm. Of some of them, yeah. Um, that was okay. It, yeah, it's, it's just chocolate. It well, the chocolate in the um, the chocolate chip cookie was better. I thought it was a richer chocolate. It it had more of a. Uh, it just tasted like it was better quality chocolate. This almost tastes like it was made by a completely different yeah. company. I, I just didn't think it was as, it tasted as good as the first one. Right. Um, it was okay. Okay, let's do a heart. We have a salted caramel heart. And they give you two of these salted caramel hearts on top. Mmm. That's a good salted caramel. That is incredible. Mm -hmm. It's really good. It is so mm -hmm. over the top sweet. Mm -hmm. And then you get that saltiness kick in. And I like the texture. Yeah, it's a, it's a runnier caramel, caramel, but it's a good. It's just a good texture overall. And the chocolate's good. But the chocolate around the outside is really thick. It's a mm -hmm. it's a thick um, coating of it. And so you have to bite through that first. So even though it's a, a milk chocolate, it still has a crispness to it, uh, like a dark chocolate, yeah. but not as crisp. Yeah. Very, very good. Yeah, that would be like a five out of five for me. I think so, that's delicious. So you want to do the dark? Yeah, let's part? go ahead and do the dark part. It's completely opposite now. This one is called a hazelnut nougat. So and there's two of these as well. Yes. Yeah, this one's a firm chocolate. 
So there won't be a picture of the inside. That's a nice creamy, um, not super dark, but a little dark chocolate flavor. It's, it's, it's good. I don't really get hazelnut, but. I like how it. Um, I like the texture. I like, yes, I because like it's, it's creamy enough to where it coats the whole inside of your mouth. Mm -hmm. Uh, so that you get the flavor everywhere. It's you not do. just there and gone, but the hazelnut um, It's not strong at all. No, it, I mean there may be some hazelnut there But I think it, it's more of a dark chocolate. Yeah, it's the, the dark chocolate takes over So you, that's what you're tasting is dark chocolate, but it's not nice. the first one I tried tasted more like hazelnut than that one did. Yeah, this one, <laughs> yeah, there's hardly any hazelnut yeah, there. It's still really good though. Okay, let's try the wavy one. There's one of them and it looks like a floof, a hair floof. You know, that <laughs> Andrew calls it that, a floof. Um, I'm going to try to cut it. It is a tir tiramisu flavored chocolate. I think, like color. I think you got me more. Yeah. I got more of some of them too. So. Mm. You get the coffee flavor almost mm -hmm. immediately. And the little crunchies. Mm -hmm. I like those. You do like those? Mm -hmm. They're like little um, sugar crystals. Mm -hmm. It's not like um, it's coffee not, nibs or whatever. No, because those are like like flakes. Like coffee bean. The yeah. Little, but yeah. It's, it's not, not like, like that. that. This is more like sugar. Yes, but the coffee flavor is very, very strong, and mm -hmm. you know exactly what that flavor yeah, it, is. Yeah, I like it, but it's yeah. also very sweet. And so, it's creamy. And it's got a good creaminess. Okay. So this one, this um, is called a double layer Ooh. nougat. Yeah, so there's two that colors on top. It looks like it's vanilla and chocolate ice cream laid on top of a cookie. Yeah. <laughs> double layer nougat. Yeah, I love the texture. You can get two of those on top. I love how it melts into like this creamy, pasty kind of. That, that one is more pasty. That's yeah. a great word to describe that. And it, honestly, yeah. the flavors aren't super, super strong. It's got like a little bit of a chocolate flavor. No, but, but it is it's different. It's really good though. It is different. Um, I like that one. It is like the uh, the flavor of the inside of like a Milky Way. Yeah, that, yeah I can remind you of that. Uh, with bit. the chocolate. And it, it is kind of pasty. Okay, That's this good. one with the dome top is a hazelnut nougat with whole hazelnut. So there's gonna be a whole hazelnut in the center. And there's there's I'm one of those. It's in that little bumper. Right yes, there. in the dome. Yep. Did you get any of that? <laughs> yeah. It's good too. Mm-hmm. Once again, I don't get a super strong hazelnut flavor, but it's still good. You get a little bit. Okay. I got almost the whole hazelnut because of the way he had to cut it. You can really taste the hazelnut. Well, I get the hazelnut now. Like, after I've eaten it, I'm okay. left with a little bit of a hazelnut flavor. So, all the other ones that said, the, 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 what were there, one or two, they really have not had that hazelnut flavor at all. This one did. There was just that one. Yeah, that this very one. very specifically said hazelnut. Yeah, this one did taste like hazelnut. Uh, that was really, really nice. The That's other good. one, I still, I never really got it in the other one, but this one was nice. Okay, so let's try this one. You get two of these. This is a vanilla and caramel truffle. Hmm. So it should be soft. I'm trying to find the best way to cut it. Vanilla, I would think it would have a seam. Yeah, there you go. Ooh, and you do get a layer of caramel. Did you get enough of it? Yeah, a layer of caramel and a layer of vanilla on the inside. I like that. I love the vanilla. Yes. But, yeah, that and the caramel together, they do a terrific job with their caramel, don't mm -hmm. they? Yeah, the other caramel is probably the best ones. That's delicious. And with the, the vanilla? The vanilla puts it over the top. Mm-hmm. 
Mm -hmm. I can have a whole box of just those. Those are really good. Those are five out of five. Delicious. They just, they really know their. Um, that vanilla kind of reminds me of like a Lindor a little bit. Mm -hmm. A little a little bit firmer, but not. Right, but it's delicious. This is just caramel. Period. Oh, just you. just caramel. So, we've already established they have good caramel. Good caramel. It's very, very nice. It's 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 like the other caramels, except this one doesn't have uh, the, the amount of salt that the one in the beginning had. Yeah, that salted caramel was like right. over the top. It really did have the salt. This is just the sweetness of the caramel mm -hmm. without the, the salt. Mm -hmm. It still is incredible. And you get that good chocolate They selection. need to do, if they don't already, they should do just a caramel, a caramel selection. selection. So like where you get caramel, sea salt caramel, you get the caramel and vanilla. They could do all kinds of caramels, mm -hmm. but they need to do a caramel box yeah. if they don't already. You don't have to have this many flavors, just have five. Yeah. Uh, this is a milk chocolate almond cream. I'm getting that cherry kind of flavor from the almond. Mm. That texture is really good. It's a thicker cream. Mm -hmm. It is delicious. That's excellent. And it does it does taste like cherry. Mm -hmm. It took rare. me a minute to get it, but it absolutely you would think you were eating something with cherry in it. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. If you That's like, good. you need to like almond. Oh, this seems like a two this is called chocolate cream with chopped hazelnuts. So we'll see if this one tastes like hazelnut. Like a dark center. Hey, the texture of the hazelnuts. It's a darker chocolate. Yeah, because the the, cho the once again the chocolate overpowers it. I do like it. Mm, I good. think it's delicious. Um, you do get the little bits of hazelnut, mm -hmm. but you really don't taste it. No. Really, the only one I've tasted hazelnut in is that hazelnut nougat. The one that nougat, had the one with, Yeah, with the, one with the <laughs> whole hazelnut in it. Then you tasted the hazelnut. The other ones I haven't really, but they're still very, very yeah, it's delicious. Very good. Um, I think we only have two left. The maybe? long one and the bumpy one? Uh, yes. The... Let's do the long one. It is almond and hazelnut cluster in milk chocolate. Hmm. And it, it has lots of hazelnuts in it. You definitely taste hazelnut in that one because it's all mm -hmm. hazelnut. It's got just enough chocolate to hold the hazelnuts together. Mm -hmm. mm, it's good. It's perfect though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is a good combination. Because as someone who likes all that, that texture, mm -hmm. and I'm a, um, love a nut, the nut flavor anyway, and all those hazelnuts, it's just terrific. I love that. It's really I right. could eat that again and again, and they only give you one on each layer. Yeah. So because it is a larger piece, but that is, that is incredible. I like that very much. This last one is called Toffee Crisp, and you get two of these. It almost looks like it's on a cookie. It's almost like a. It reminds you of caramel a little bit. Mm -hmm. But it's chewier, mm -hmm. like it's a thicker, yes. denser caramel. Yes. Mm. That's really good too. Mm. That's one of my favorite ones. Because it has that caramel, but it also it's has still, a vanilla flavor. Yeah, that's. I think that's the difference in it. Is it's um, the the caramel that they use is a runnier caramel, and mm -hmm. this is thicker. But Kevin hit it when he said it. It's it uh, tastes more like vanilla mm -hmm. than it does caramel. Yeah, um, and it is it is very delicious. So it's kind of a toffee like. It's hard to believe we've already eaten. I know thirteen. Thirteen. Thirteen pieces. 
I'm gonna tell you, my two favorite are probably that toffee crisp and the salted caramel heart, but I would also put that vanilla and caramel in there too. So those three would be the ones I would eat a whole box of. Yeah, uh, I would eat a whole box of any of the caramel ones. Yeah. Like I said before, I think they, if my favorite one of the whole box was that salted caramel. The salted caramel is the best one, yeah. Um, and, and I could make myself sick eating, mm -hmm. eating a lot of those. Um, this is when did you say Absolutely. it was? Eight or nine bucks? It was nine dollars, and yeah. I think it's worth oh, 100 every percent worth every penny. time of that. There wasn't one flavor in here that we did not like. Now, yeah, even the tiramisu, which is not a flavor I would normally gravitate towards, was still really good. <laughs> yes, it was delicious. So even though the hazelnut wasn't strong in the ones with dark chocolate, it still is excellent quality chocolate. Mm, so good flavors. we have spent a lot more on boxes of chocolate. And you get a lot less chocolate and they weren't as good. And then yes, <laughs> and there was like always some that it's like, it was so disappointing. This, every single piece is good. Yeah, they did a good job. Now, the only- And you get the pretty tin to keep. You do, I love the tin and I will, I, I'm absolutely going to keep this tin. Um, because I've always wanted it. This looks like uh, Sleeping Beauty's Palace or mm -hmm. something. I mean, it's absolutely stunning. Um, and I've always seen pictures of it anyway. Um, the only bad thing is when we, when I bought this at Aldi, at our Aldi, it was the only one on the shelf. The last one. And I thought, oh, this is mine. <laughs> you know? Um, so, I don't know if you all are going to be able to find it this uh, year. I don't know um, if this is something that Aldi has all the time. Do they come out with them at different seasons? You know what? Valentine's Day. Might have something similar to they, they might have something that comes out like this for Valentine's Day, the Chakura brand. If they do, you need to get you one. They yeah, you really very, very do. Good. This would be an awesome gift for yourself or to give to someone uh, that you're close to, a coworker even, a boss, a, you know, anybody. This is a terrific gift. Yeah, 110 buck gift. Can't go wrong Can't go with wrong. that. Yeah, anybody would be happy to get that and they get to keep the, the tin. Yeah, unless they're allergic to chocolate. Yeah, then you won't be buying chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> so, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I will have a picture of one of the layers, just not the inside, because I don't want to cut all those up just for a picture. Uh, you all saw it during the video, and uh, if you buy it yourself, you'll see. So, I hope you enjoyed, and thanks for watching.